Here we are at a new boat landing on the Brawl River, Dalton Landing. First time we've been here. I have ambivalent feelings about this place. I'm worried they're going to corrupt the river. Now upstream is 99 Island. Well, you go to buy a bridge at 211, then up above that is 99 Island. But that's the uh, the first public boat landing on the river upstream from here. Downstream, if you put in here, the only place you can get out is Lockhart. And I've been down there several times. There's a deer stand. A nice, nice job they did. Our worst fears come true. Trash, litter bugs. Same guy, smoking Swisher sweets. That's what bothers me. It's got a good flow, Mike. You can't, you can't put this in your pocket and walk out with it. Inbred. There's footprint. You know they. Look at that flow. Now you're going to encounter, I know there's rapids on up the river. If you put it in 99 Island and got out here, you would encounter several nice set of rapids. You put in here and go all the way to Lockhart, well, eventually you're going to come into where the packlet comes in, and we, we did that, you remember? And then the river's going to, there won't be no rapids all the way to Lockhart. But if you keep going this where way. Where that big sandbar was, where yeah, the packlet yeah, came yeah. in. If you keep going, the packlet's going to come in on your right. And me and you put in at 105 on the packlet and took it all the way to Lockhart where it ran into the brawl. I, I just have fears. Floor. Oh, yeah. Of course, it rained in the mountains uh, last night. There was, a, there was big rain across the north part of Charlotte. But I don't think that that's what this is. This is... Well, this is all part of Worth Mountain, which is open to the public. If you got a hunting license and a WMA uh, pass, then across, I think, is, is private property. And I see some no trespassing signs down there on the left. I don't know if that's private or part of Worth Mountain. But this part here, my understanding from here on up, is Worth Mountain. Oh, it's a pretty place. Man, look at the rock. Yeah. Right in here. They did a ton of that stuff. Jeez. Really nice job they did. Yeah. But Joe came down here when I was at the powwow and sent me a picture. We're going to have to, we'll put in at 99 and get out here, and then we'll put in here and go the rest of the way. How far do you think there. that is up there? I, I looked on the map and maybe, maybe three hours, maybe less. What if it's flowing like this? But there's there's two islands up there that I'd like to explore, and several, about six or seven creeks coming in, and I like to explore. Beautiful place. I just hope it I don't hope get messed it stays up. It's beautiful. I see a beaver stick. I bust my butt to get over there and get it. We should have brought kayaks. We take off. So cool for me. More fair weather kayak. Ah, uh, just get you a wetsuit. This is what you come out to places like this for. You yeah. Kayak down through here, and you see stuff that it's so quiet. Now up north, where you from? Do y'all have places like this? No. They got them in southern Illinois, way, but that's 350 miles south. No, we've got the Des Plaines River, and it's never this wide where we're from. And you could uh, actually get a little of this, but not much. Beautiful. And we saw turkeys coming in. I imagine there's all kind of game down here. Stick for a child's canoe. That's what you need to whip them with right there. Get, get moving on down there, room. Really. Clean your room up, I'll cut your ass. 
Ah, it's beautiful. Love it. Love it. Can't wait to do it. The beautiful Broad River. Below Hickory Grove, South Carolina. Love it. Film at 11.